In this demonstration, I'm going to install CA Release Automation Continuous Delivery Edition. At this point, I've downloaded the installation file and extracted it so that I have the WAR files available on my local computer. The first thing I need to do is stop the Apache Tomcat service. So I've switched to my services window, and from here, I'll right click and shut the service down. The service is stopped, so now I'm ready to begin installation. What I need to do is copy these files into the Web Apps folder of the Apache Tomcat installation. And with that done, I can switch back to my services window and restart the Apache Tomcat service. Now it's a good idea to wait a few minutes after you've started the Apache Tomcat service to make sure that everything is up and running properly. And once I've waited a few minutes, I'll open up a browser window and enter the path to the CDD installation. In my case, the name of the server where the product is installed is release, it's port 8080, and then slash CDD, and when the page is up and running, I'm at the installer folder. I'm going to accept the default home folder, which we'll also call the configuration folder, of .cdd and click Set. At this point, I'll set my database connection properties, and at that point, I'll click Save. The installer takes a few minutes to get ready, so I'll pause the recording until we've reached the next step. To log in, I'll use the credentials superuser at ca.com and the password suser. And when I reached the releases page, that indicates that my installation was successful. Music